dear friends of the world, Paul the trombonist here. I missed you all so incredibly much. It was only like three days, it seemed like forever. But we're back, and today is gonna be a great day. Because we're gonna talk a little bit about what it takes to become a professional musician. The first thing kind of goes without saying, and that is to simply become the very best you can possibly be at your music-related avenue. A great educator once told me that the best always work. So if you become the best at whatever field that you are wanting to aspire to be in, people are not going to be able to not notice you. You're going to stand out and the word of mouth is going to get out. There's one thing about honing your craft inside the practice room or in the studio. The next thing that you need to take care of is you need to let people know that you exist. It could be the greatest thing in the world. But if people don't know you exist, you're never going to get called for anything. So a way to accomplish that is to get active, get involved, do as many collaborations with people as you can think of. If you're an instrumental musician, go to as many jam sessions as you can think of. Go to the rehearsal bands, the community orchestras, the local colleges, uh, get active in any music type of scene, the open mic nights. Go to all these things, let people know that you exist. You need to let people know that you exist. It's very important. Communication. I can't stress how important communication is. You have to communicate to people. I'm talking write them back in a timely manner when they reach out to you, thanking people for hiring you for certain things to show your appreciation, writing people back, communicating. Communicating is one of the things that can make or break it for somebody. So they could have the ability the notoriety where people know they exist and then they can lack on the communication you know it takes a lifetime to build a reputation and just an instant to destroy it one other mindset that a lot of professional musicians have is they set goals this is what I'm gonna accomplish this month this is what I'm gonna accomplish this month I'm gonna get this done today and then and they cross it off the list I actually personally enjoy this so much writing down my goals and then the feeling I get from crossing them off the list is just a feeling that I just look forward to so much so I just want to get the things done so I can cross them off the list it's something about writing things down and crossing them off a list that makes you feel so incredibly satisfied quality attribute that professional musicians have is they're very persistent they don't ever give up they're never satisfied unless they get a response from somebody that's something that you're gonna want you're gonna want that persistence that drive professional musicians have is they're very very creative with creating multiple sources of income they get creative with the ways to make money through music. And there are many, and many people forget about. And the list is huge. My two cents about what it takes to become a professional musician. And if you have any questions, leave them down in the comment section. Maybe we'll get to them on the next video and respond to them. You never know here. The Music Man for Life says, Paul, can you do a video where you play the trombone without a mouthpiece? Well, actually, the Music Man for Life, thank you for leaving a comment. Yeah, actually, I have done that. Hope you enjoyed that. That's just a little preview. I actually have that up. I put that up. It's called trombone no mouthpiece you can look it up i'll put a link in the description i do that i want to thank you all so incredibly much for watching i put up a video every tuesday and saturday so if you haven't already subscribe to the channel and as i said before that little bell you're going to want to click the little bell because when you click the bell you're going to get the notified when subscriptions happen if not it gets lost in the algorithm of subscriptions it's very confusing 
Also on my Snapchat at Jazz Trombonist, every Monday I give away some music that I recorded. It's called Free Music Monday. So you're gonna want to follow the Snapchat and on all the other social networks. You're really awesome. Mm. <laughs> the way my uh, debut album Journey to the World is out. For those of you that know, it had charted on the first week on Amazon bestseller list. Links down below. You're gonna want to check that one out. If you can leave a review on that, it's pretty fun. Oh gosh, I talk so much that my voice turns into a chicken. You are the best. I'll see you at the next.